Hello everyone, and welcome to Atomica S200. This is a demonstration on how to scan a diagnostic full arch scan using Atomica S200 Intraural Scanner. Before you start scanning, there are two important points that would highly affect your scan quality. The first one is dryness. Before scanning, make sure that the teeth surface is as dry as possible. This could be achieved using the air water syringe. The second point is good retraction. The simplest way to have good retraction is to use your index finger to retract the cheeks. And both your index and middle finger retract the lips. Also using cotton rolls will serve in function for both dryness and retraction. Connect the scanner to your laptop and start a new case. First thing you have to set a reference point to start with. This could be the occlusal surface of the most posterior molar because of the unique and distinctive anatomy of the occlusal surfaces. Then move the scanner in a zigzag manner, moving between buccal and palatal surfaces. Or you can start by scanning the occlusal surface alone, then finish the buccal surface and head to the palatal. You can try both techniques and then choose which one that gives you more comfort. Same for the anterior teeth. Start in sisal and move labial and palatal. Tilt the scanner to move to the other side and use the same technique. Once you finish the upper arch, click on the gray button. You can easily rotate the scan by rotating the scanner. Click on the switch mode button to start scanning the lower arch. Use the same technique for scanning. Click on the gray button when you're done with the lower arch and click the mode button to activate the bite registration. Move the scanner on the buckle side while the teeth are in occlusion till the scanner reads the bite and stops and it will automatically allow you to scan the other side. You can either tilt the scanner or change direction of the tip for easier handling. And now your scan is ready for exporting. 